Okay, so this recording is for all new presenters that have recently signed up and are wondering what to do, where to go, and how to do it. So I'm going to show you a couple places that you can go. The first place is your website. I want you to go to your website. Just one second, it's loading. I want you to go to your website, log in, click My Office, and go down here to Weekly Courses. Okay? First thing you want to do, go to your weekly courses. Learn your weekly courses. Do week one, week two, week three, week four, week five. I, not everybody does these first. I, when I signed up, did like to go through these. The reason for that is because I wanted to know everything. I wanted to know how to get started about my kit, how to party, how to be a leader, and then really know how to do my back office. So start with these weekly courses. All you do is click on it and it's going to load that up for you and you literally just read through and there's a bunch of different links and things that you can click on as well. Okay, so this is the first place that you want to go. To your unique website, my office, and then weekly courses. Finish those five weekly courses, get out a pen and paper, Write down all the questions that you may have for your sponsor or elite upline and then set up a call with them and ask them all those questions so that they can be answered for you. The next thing that we're going to do is we are going to go, I'm going to click out of some of these really quickly, is we have our unique website, which we were just at, and our upline, Michelle Bell, actually made an awesome website for us that is called The Lash Divas. So it's www.thelashdivas.com, okay? There is a password. You're going to scroll down here. Um, you're going to see all the resources and everything. And the place that I want you to go is presenter training and support. I also have another video that talks about all of the things that are on this awesome website. But for now, I just want you to go to presenter training and support. And I want you to click New Presenter Training. This is your new presenter orientation, okay? And what I'm going to do today is I'm going to go over these steps with you and kind of talk you through it and what you should do. Your sponsor or elite upline should be scheduling a time with you to do your online or over-the-phone training or in person if she's near you. If your sponsor has not set up a training, contact Michelle Bell. Here's her website, so if for some reason your sponsor hasn't set up a training, you can contact Michelle Bell, but before you contact her, just contact your sponsor and say, hey, can we set up a training? If she doesn't reply, go up the line rather than going straight to Michelle. Okay, so go up to your elite upline and go up from there. We just don't want Michelle getting bombarded with all of the questions of how they can get trained because we're all here to help you and we're all here to train you. So the next thing is knowledge is key to confidence. Take the time to get trained and learn how to work the business. Lots of people love to just jump into the business and dive in, which is awesome. But in any job, you have to have some sort of knowledge of the business. And I was somebody that liked to learn every single thing before I started the business. But I have some people underneath of me that aren't like that. They like to dive in and learn as they go. Either way is fine, but make sure that you do this orientation and you go through the weekly courses as well because you want to make sure that you feel prepared if somebody asks you a question. You want to know how to correctly answer that. Okay, so we're super excited for you to get started. It's important to do some training and get some insight on the best way to share products before you start. Step one. First thing is let's check out your new amazing website. So we just visited our website. You're now official. Log into your website. Look around. Go to all of your different tabs and things like that. Click on my office, which I showed you before, and make sure that you go to everything. This is telling you step one is weekly courses. I already showed you how to do that. But this is just kind of breaking it down for you. And like she says, notebook and write down any notes that you may have. So this is going to be your first step is those weekly courses and getting to know your website. I also have a video on your website if you are interested. If you don't know how to work it, you can watch that video. It goes through all the tabs, how to do everything on your website. Step two 
will be to read through the current presenter policies. It's important, really, really important that you know what you can't do because you don't want to break the rules, okay? You signed the contract, even if you don't know it, when you signed up to become a presenter, you agreed to the presenter policies. Lots of you didn't read it. I know I didn't read it before I joined. People just click yes and we join. But you did sign it. You need to make sure that you know what it is and how to go about it. Here's a couple things on there. There's no selling on third party sites like Craigslist, eBay, Amazon, buy, sell, trade, Facebook groups. No Facebook groups at all. Okay, so if you have a garage sale site, you can't say, hey, I've got all this cash and carry. Want to come pick it up at my house? You are not allowed to do that, and you cannot go on Craigslist or eBay. You can risk losing your entire business for doing this, so please abide to these rules. Next one is no offering people incentives to join your team as a presenter. So don't say, hey, I'm going to pay for your kit for you if you join because all I need is one more presenter to hit fast start or something like that. You can't say, hey, I'll give you a free mascara if you join my team today. You're not allowed to offer incentives for things like that. No spam. Don't put your website link on other people's website, YouTube videos, or Instagram posts that you didn't create or solicit. So if somebody does a review and they say, order from Kara. Kara is amazing. Here's her link down in the description. Don't go on there and post your website in the comments. It's disrespectful and very rude and it just puts a bad name to us. So make sure that you don't do that. Um, give that attention to them and find somebody to review your product for you so that you can be the star of a video and a star of a review, okay? So read through your presenter guide, get to know it. If you have more questions on it too, there are different files and things on all of your different group pages that you are a part of that will break down more parts of your presenter policy, especially because it's so long and hard to understand in some parts so there are tons of different files that you can look at that are going to tell you things like this and ask your sponsor or your elite upline as well if you're confused about something ask before you do it okay just ask a question and we're here to help you step three watch this new presenter orientation this is coming soon it's not here yet but it's going to go over the basics of how you get paid how much you earn and information about the products. It's a knowledge based video and there is a video that we have of how to make money with Unique which is an awesome video that you can also watch as well. So if you want to do that one, that one's also by Michelle Bell and that one is available for you to use if you would like to. And just again contact your sponsor or your elite upline if you want to know where that video is at. Step 4 Set up a one-on-one -on -one time to do trainings with your sponsor. So if your sponsor is unavailable, contact your upline elite leader. So if you have a non-responsive or, you know, a sponsor that is not willing to help you, contact your upline elite. That means an upline elite is a green status presenter or above. Okay? So if your um, sponsor maybe is only pink, that is completely fine. And if she you know, is unavailable to help you, then contact her sponsor, which is probably going to be your elite leader, and ask them for help. If you aren't sure who that is, just go ahead and message Michelle, and she'll tell you who that is. She'll, you know, let you know who you can talk to and who can help you out through this. You can also look up your elite leader as well. Um, if you want to go on your website, under if you go to my office and my royalties, you will be able to see who your elite leader is in your upline. Before you do your training, please print out these two worksheets. I'm going to show you them really quick. Oh, it's not showing up. I will find those for you and I can um, get those to you if you need them. Just let me know. I'm not sure why that isn't showing up. But just message me and I can figure out how I can get that to you. So set up the one-on-one -on -one training with your sponsor and make sure once you get, once you're able to get the training worksheet, you can fill that out and do that and keep that for your business. 
One important fact about your new business is it's your business. You're responsible for the success of your business. Your sponsor is not responsible, although she should fully be invested in your success. Your commission will have your name on it, not your sponsor's. But if you don't feel like you are getting the support you need, then it is up to you to ask. The website is an amazing source to training and help. Please use it to learn and improve your skills, which will help improve your business. Go upline if you need additional help. That means if your sponsor is not able to help you, go up to your elite upline. And if that fails, go up to your upline exclusive leader. While your leaders want you to succeed, they cannot do the work for you. So once again, your success is 100% up to you. But we will be here every step of the way to train, support, and cheer you on. And this is your business. And I believe that this is a link that you can watch something on. Let's see. This is my first time on here. We'll go ahead and watch this right now since we're on here. Hey, Glam Gurus. I am sitting in my car waiting for my son. We just finished a golf tournament after I worked out. He did amazing. So proud of him. So my phone is dead, so I'm using my computer. That's why I have, like, this huge screen. Um, anyway, so I just want to say a couple things. I had a girl that sent a message to me yesterday. She's not on my downline at all. She's not on our team. And she just wanted to know what I did to become successful with Unique. She said and her, she is, she's hit yellow, which is amazing. Super proud of her. But um, she has no support system. She said she signed up. Her sponsor does nothing. She never talks to her. And I said, you know what? This business is your business. It is fabulous to have a sponsor that loves you and coaches you and mentors you and answers your questions and all that and is your biggest cheerleader. But this is your business. Your sponsor is not the one that is going to get you to that next level. It is up to you personally. So we signed up to sell products. We sell makeup, people. We sell products. If you are in this business, you should be sharing the love and sponsoring, I'm sorry, selling consistently. It's just part of the business. You cannot expect to go to the next level if you're not doing everything you can possibly think of to share the love. It's, it's about people feed off your excitement. The other thing is sponsoring. I know people want to promote, want to promote, want to promote, as we all do, but you have got to continually sponsor. You can't just sponsor a few and then stop and coast. That is not how your business grows. And it can become kind of stale if you just stop. So look at your business. Are you sharing the love constantly? Are you really, truly proactively trying to sell daily and, you know, getting it in front of people, selling on the go, sharing on the go? Um, that's a huge part of it. And that will that will really help your business. So daily actions will equal results. So of course the results are your you know your end goal is what we're all going for. But you need to look at your daily actions and take them daily. Carve out that time. I know lots of us have full time jobs. Um, this is my full time job. We have cops. We have lawyers. We have nurses. We have doctors. We have teachers. We I think we have every industry out there um, that is a part of our business, and they just have to go around their schedule and make that. If you've got kids, go around their schedule or whatever. So if you want it bad enough, there should be no excuses. It is totally your business. It's up to you to become successful. I am here to help. Others are here to help. Um, whatever. But anyways, I just wanted to say that everyone, y'all are doing fabulous. I know it's, you know, it's, it's an amazing business. If you put your mind to it, anything can happen. Okay, have a wonderful week. Okay, see ya. Bye. All right. So that was, I believe her name is Valerie. And she was just kind of talking to us really quick about your sponsors. And she is so helpful. Um, and not just kind of gave you an insight. It's your business. Okay, ladies, your business. You can do whatever you want with it. Um, and I hope that was, I hope you were able to hear that okay and I hope that you were able to get something out of that and realize to not be discouraged if your sponsor quits, okay? If you have a sponsor that decided this isn't for her, that does not mean that this isn't for you. So make sure that you stay with it because there's always going to be help out there for you. You just have to ask for it. The next step is listening to the following calls. We're not going to listen to these ones on here because they are long, but these are going to help you. They are going to 
help you be so much more excited and pumped and the first one is how to jumpstart your business and the second one is by Sarah Robbins and she's talking about building big. I have watched both of these a few times because I love them. They are awesome videos so make sure that you watch these and listen to I, I think they're calls, actually. I don't think that they're videos. But listen to them. Listen to all the people, what they have to say. And make sure you get both of those done for your step number five. Step number six is to print out this worksheet to help you stay on track. I just found this worksheet about a month ago, and I'm obsessed with it. I send it to all my new girls. At the very basis of your unique business, it's simple. One is to share the products, and one is to sh or two is to share the business with those that you share the products with, and that's it. Okay, you always want to have five sets of lashes on you all the time, just in case people need them on the spot, and you want to have them in your purse. Order some Blitz cards, and if you don't know what those are, contact your sponsor. But once you print this out. Get qualified $125 PRS. Okay, so you're gonna have 125, 125, 125, 125. Okay, or sorry, no, you're not. I'm lying. You're gonna have, I believe it's 25, 25, 25, 25, 25. Sorry, saying the total wrong thing. So each one of these little circles counts as $25. Every time you get $25, you're gonna put an X mark through it. And it's a nice little visual to help you or you can just sticker on it, whatever you want. This is to recruit 5%ers, so you're going to write down their names. The next one is $2,000 in personal retail sales. If you complete this, you will, you will reach faster if you complete this in 90 days. So make sure that you complete this, okay? This is going to be an awesome success for your business. Step seven is to learn about the Fast Start program. So that's what I was just kind of saying. If you complete this in 90 days, you're going to get Fast Start. All you need for Fast Start, though, is 2,000. So you're going to have to fill up all of these stars. And you're only going to need three presenters. And those three presenters don't have to do anything. They just have to be under you. Obviously, you want them to do something, but they don't have to. So $2,000 in your own personal sales and three presenters underneath of you in your first 90 days. Your reward is $250 in Ycash. You can use it towards any unique products. Business supplies are not included, but you can buy a collection. You can buy mascaras, whatever you want. So it's practically like cash. Okay, you're going to get this. You're going to order the makeup, and then you're going to sell it and make that cash. Grab your calendar and count 90 days from the day that you signed up. If you don't know what day you signed up, Go to your website, click on My Office, click on My Accomplishments, and scroll all the way down to the bottom, and it's going to tell you the exact day that you joined and how long ago it was. Step number eight is create a presence on Facebook. You're not required to promote your business on Facebook, but if you're going to utilize Facebook, you want to do this, okay? You want to create a business fan page, and this is a little link to tell you how to get some more likes on there, so if you're interested in that, click on that, read about it. Update your personal Facebook post profile so that it's connected to your Facebook fan page. So if somebody goes onto your profile, they can it can say work at un works for unique or whatever. They can click on that and it'll automatically go to your page. Learn how to post on Facebook without selling. I highly encourage you to click on this. Share the products, ladies, don't sell them. Don't say buy my mascara or help me promote or things like that. Share personal experiences. Be personable with people because that's what they love. Next thing is, want to know more, watch this video. Um, I believe this is a little bit of a longer video too, so you are going to watch this on your own. But it's by Amber Voigt about marketing your business online. Step number nine is let's learn how to party. Take a little time to go through and how to do a party. There's more than one way to party. So watch this 30-minute video. And this these steps are time-consuming, ladies. You're not going to finish these steps in one day, okay? It is going to take a while for you, but I promise if you do these steps, you will find success in your business. Step 10 is, what do we do now? It's time to make a plan. The first one, decide how you're going to work your business. Are you going to utilize Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, Pinterest? What are you going to do? Next one is, are you going to share the product in person, through home parties, one-on-one -on -one appointments, on the go? What do you like? Are you an 
online person? Are you a one-on-one -on -one person? Do you like big crowds? Do you like to do it when you're at the grocery store, at the mall, things like that? What do you like to do and how are you going to sell? What's your income goal? You need to make a goal. You need to have a goal. Say, for the end of this month, I want to be making $300 a month extra for my family. Or I want to have an extra $100 a month to get my nails and toes done. Or I want to be on track to hit green in four months. Whatever your goal is, make your goal, write it down, post it on your mirror, by your bedside, wherever it is, so that you see it every single day. Next one is how much time can you put towards your business? Work your business for a week. And I, my first week, I kind of clocked in my times. And I saw how much time I was able to work on my business so that I knew. I like to stay organized. So say you have eight hours available for this business a week. You want to spend those eight hours wisely. You don't want to be scrolling through things and for three hours trying to find out what you should do. You want to make sure that you know exactly where to go and exactly what to be doing for those eight hours. So find out how many hours you're available and schedule them for different things that you know that you need to do. First being these steps. Right under here, it says share the goals with your sponsor because... The more you share your goals with people, the more you are going to want to accomplish them, okay? I just gave some of my girls on my team a challenge to post their goals on their timeline. And I think that this is awesome because not only does your sponsor know and your Y sisters know, but your friends and your family and your Facebook followers are going to know, okay? And this is just going to make it even more of an incentive for you to achieve those goals because everybody knows my goals I want to be purple by December everybody knows that so I'm gonna get purple by December because everybody knows and it puts some pressure on you a good type of pressure though because I want to be motivated because if I lose my motivation then I'm not gonna be successful down here it says the plan for success sell $500 PRS and sponsor three presenters every single month if you want to hit green fast this is the way to go. If you want to hit green even faster, sponsor six to ten a month and still sell five hundred dollars. Okay, sponsoring is key. Lots of presenters sign up and they're worried about sales, sales, sales. Yes, sales are important. I am not saying that you shouldn't sell or that you should only sell the bare minimum because at first all you're making is percentages off your sales. But in the long run, if you want to be black or you want to be green or you just want to be successful, sponsoring is the key. Sponsor as many people as you can and get them to learn and grow with you because they like that. They like to know that you're new and you're fresh and you can learn together. Um, and follow this formula and you can be a green level presenter within about four months. I always suggest sponsoring more people than three people a month if you want to be green that fast. I think I sponsored about six to eight and I reach screen in about four months because not all of those people are gonna work right alright I believe that is it I clicked on the next one though um, what you're gonna wanna do is get connected with the team sorry I there are a couple different topics so get connected with the team subscribe to the mailing list you want to be part of this you want to type in all of this information hit subscribe that just means that you're gonna get the weekly or monthly emails from Michelle Bell which is awesome you definitely want to be able to get those and these are the groups this is a new question and answer group that you can be added to and this is the pop group so this is like the family group and um, where all of the corporate you know the founders and people they post on it I only add my girls to my upline elite group just because everything that is posted in either one of these groups I post in my group okay so you don't have to be a part of these groups ask your sponsor see what she thinks if you want to the more the merrier you can totally be a part of those groups I'm not saying you can't but a lot of the time you'll just see repeated information okay the next one it's going to be customer support, what to do when you get orders on your site. This is just going to go through exactly what you should do. Here are tips to how to apply the mascara. You're going to want to send these to all of your customers. You want to update the links to your website. Um, don't send 
the people to Michelle's site, okay? So if you're doing, you know, copying, pasting things, you don't want to leave Michelle's right here. You don't want to leave this, okay? If you're going to copy this and paste it, you need to change her name or they're going to go to her page and buy from her and you want them to buy from you. Um, if you love the products, consider hosting a party or why not join as a presenter so they click on this and that's going to take them straight to um, the link where they can join as a presenter. The next topic is going to be start your first party. So you're going to want to go on and you're going to want to set up a party. Part 1 is 5 minutes, part 2 is 5 minutes. Make sure you watch those. How to promote your launch party. So this is going to go through, and I'm not going to go through all of these with you just for time's sake, but just read through all of these. This tells you literally step by step what to do, what to send, how to do it, how many parties to book. It also gives you a ratio, which I love. 15 parties a week, 2,000 to 2,500 PRS per week, which is seven to 10,000 PRS per month. Awesome, right? If you can find 15 people a um, week, you're set, okay? So book parties. And if there's an incentive for the current month that you're in with parties, make sure to push that incentive and tell people about it, okay? Next topic is going to be know the presenter policies. So this is kind of what we went over before with what you can and you cannot do. Like you can't go on Craigslist. Um, you can't get other leads from people's other people's reviews and you can't spam different people. So read through these. Make sure you know exactly what those mean. The next one is start making your list, okay? Make a list of 100 people. I want you, Wilma, okay? If you don't know this, learn it. Who is a likely marketing audience? These are the people, okay? These are the people that are going to be a good audience. You want to find 100 of them that you know, write their names down, okay? Who can help you get in front of a bigger audience? Parties are one of the ways to do a business, but not the only way. You can find a makeup artist. She's going to tell all of her friends if she loves the lashes, and then everybody's going to love them. Another quick thing on this page is the three C's. When you're talking to somebody, use these three C's. Crazy compliment confidence. So you're going to start out with, oh my goodness, you're not going to believe this. I sell this amazing, crazy 3D fiber lash mascara and then you're going to want to compliment them. You're going to want to say something like, you have gorgeous eyes, this would be so good on you. And then you're going to want to say something to build their confidence. Say something like, you are so sweet and so kind, and I could see you going so far in this business. And, you know, build that confidence up for them. Use those three C's, and I promise that that will help you. And here's some more, comp or more examples down here as well. Next topic is going to be to book those parties. You want to book at least six parties this week. So once you're on number seven, this is your goal, okay? This is your ultimate goal. Six parties, no if, ands, or but, find six people, okay? The next one, number eight, is going to be social media savvy. So this is when you want to get really savvy with your social media. Um, you want to and this is going to go through everything, but you want to get really good at Facebook. You want to learn how to use your profile, things like that. Next topic is you are going to talk less, listen more. This is number nine. This is a big one, ladies. Keep it short and sweet and stop talking, okay? You don't want to talk somebody's ear off about the business, you don't want to say, well, we do this and unique, and we do that and unique. And, you know, if you're going out with your friends, you don't want to blab about unique the whole time. It's going to annoy people. Keep it short. Keep it sweet. Keep it simple. Okay? The more simple, more short, and the more sweet you make it, the more appealing it looks. So talk less, listen more. Number 10 is going to be cash and carry is golden. And this is a little picture about cash and carry it's awesome. You want to have at least five on you at a time. Carry some in your purse with um, blitz cards, things like that. This lady, she said, update on my outgoing to date. Bam. Sold a set of lashes right outside Old Navy. She commented on my hair, asked where I had it done, told her 
to tell Megan, my hairstylist, to tell me the Lash Lady Center. She says, what? I gave her my card and showed her my lashes. One I done and one I not. She bought right there. Had one in my purse and she's going to book a party and she sent up me a friend request. Woohoo! Getting out of my comfort zone. And this is going to make other people be more intrigued by you. So share your personal stories with Cash and Carrie as well. Okay? This is the end. What to do now? Pencil in 20 to 30 minutes each day can to continue learning. Watch a new session. Watch a new video. You're always going to learn something new. I can't tell you how many times I have watched certain videos over and over and over again. And depending on the point of your life that you're in, you're going to take out a different part of that. That is going to help you be more successful. So make this your goal to complete these 10 steps within your first month. Okay? And I promise if you can do that, if you can work on it and you can give it time and devote yourself to this company, you will succeed. And I am so happy that you have joined Unique. You don't know how blessed you are going to be. This company has blessed so many wonderful ladies. It has blessed me in my life with my financial future. And I cannot wait to see you grow and to see you turn into a wonderful, successful woman. I hope you all enjoyed this and learned something. Have a wonderful day. Thanks.